Hello community, we have a second open source LLM and this time it is called Jamba and it is very special because it is a hybrid Mamba transformer architecture and just two hours ago it was uploaded to Hugging Face and now we have it available for a simple download and now let's have a look and yeah compare it also with Databricks. So here on the left side, you have Databricks, the Databricks RX, a mixture of expert model with 132 billion free trainable parameters, where we have 36 billion live parameters. Chamba, also a mixture of expert system, has a total of 52 billion free trainable parameters and 12 active parameters. So 34 billion active parameters, 12 billion active parameters. Yeah, context length here is 32K. And here, of course, with a Mamba SSM structure, we have 256K token length. Beautiful. However, please notice that with Databricks, we have an instruction fine-tuned model we can use directly out of the box. Jamba is only pre-trained, it is not fine-tuned, it has no safety rail, it is a bad boy LLM. Beautiful. But if what is nice, it is an open source, also our second open source brand new LLM this week, Apache 2 license. Isn't this fantastic? And I know what you want to know, you want to know, hey, how is the Jamba block from the architecture, from the coding, what they do? Here we have it. And yeah, thanks to AI21 Labs for open source, this beautiful new hybrid of a self-attention transformer network with a state space model. And you see, we have here the classical structure that we know for a state space model here with a mixture of expert. And you might say, where is here now the self-attention from the transformer integrated? Where's this beautiful hybrid? And yes, it is only one layer here in the middle. And you see, maybe there is here in the Mamba and the mixture of expert layer, we have also a self-attention, a transformer, a quadratic complexity. Maybe we do have here this deeper insight and you go here to the scientific uh, technical paper and you see, no, the Mamba layer is a classical Mamba layer. And the Mamba and mixture of expert layer is the classical one. So please note, a little bit disappointing that the attention is only in the decoder block and not here in the mixture of expert block, which would have been beautiful. But hey, we have the first hybrid, so it starts simple. And here I take something from Maxime Labon. This is his Twitter handle. Please go there, like it. He has a beautiful here visualization. You remember Mistral 7B and then Mistral went to a mixture of expert Mixtral model with, for example, three experts. And this here was a simplification of the architectural layout of this LLM. So here the simple Mistral and here the Mixtral with three experts. And if we have a look at this, and now we look here at this brand new model, we can say that Jamba has a very similar architecture to Mixtral. Now this is good because we know that Mixtral, our mixture of expert from Mistral blocks works really well. So if Jamba has a similar architecture with a thing that works well, we will guess that Jamba is also working great. So beautiful. This is just to get you warm up. And there is a special bonus here from Maxime Labon. He gives this to us and he looks here at the code. He goes through the code. And he built here the Jamba Attention Decoder layer. And you have here the allocation here of the single code sequences here to a simplified schema. Beautiful. Now, I know what you want. You want to say, hey, let's have it. Let's try it out. Where's the inference code? It is as simple as that. Since two hours ago, we have it now available on Hugging Face. And I waited for this because otherwise it would have been a little bit more complicated, but now it is, as you know, it is standard procedure. Transformer, cause language, auto tokenizer, the model, tokenizer input. This is it. There's nothing more specific to it. You handle it here. AI 21 Labs, Jumbo version 0.1, careful, no safety rails. 
and you have hey in the recent Super Bowl whatever and then you see here the answer so now that it's on hugging face we can work with this model yes of course if you want there's an 8-bit inference available for you and they say the authors say hey you can easily quantize your jumbo to an 8-bit using bits and bytes our classical model but they know hey please careful in order not to degrade the model quality in particular here the mumble blocks they recommend to exclude the mumble blocks from the quantization and you see this here in this particular line so if you want to go here you just substitute here load in 8-bit skip models member and you can go flash attention to beautiful this is the way to go with an 8-bit yeah normally in the full-fledged version you would need two 80 gigabyte vram gpu with this you can run it on one 80 gigabyte vram and there are already experiments to bring it down to a 40 gigabyte gpu but yeah you have to go i would say with one 80 gigabyte with bits and bytes beautiful now, as I told you, it is only the pre-trained. So you have your job and you have to fine tune it for your downstream task, like chat or like summarization or like translation. So the Jumba fine tuning code is easy on the internet. There are a lot of things already happening. Just go somewhere and you find fine tuning Jumba Python file. Either you go with this version or there's the official version here with Hugging Faith with the standardized trainer, the supervised fine-tuning trainer from Hugging Face. Now that it's available on Hugging Face, you take here a particular data set, go whatever you like, whatever you find on Hugging Face. And this is the complete code for the fine-tuning of Jumba. Isn't this beautiful? It is available for you. You can start and try this out. Again, this is only a pre-trained base model, did not undergo any alignment for instruction or chat interaction. It is intended to use as a foundation layer for further fine tuning, for further training and for developing customer solution. Jumbo has no safety moderation mechanism and has, takes no responsibility. You have to be responsible and you have to make sure that you use it in a safe way. Beautiful. Now, you might say, how does it perform? And you remember that I told you Jamba has a similar architecture to Mixtral. So we believe for the moment AI21 Labs. And if you see here the reasoning, the aggregated assessment, and here you have the two RAG uh, benchmark, standard benchmark data. You see if we go here, here is Mixtral, and the last line is Jamba. So yeah, Jamba is a little bit better than Mixtral. Therefore, here in a different reasoning argument, mixed well is better. Here, Jamba is better. Jamba is better. Here, mixed well, here, uh, aggregated is better. Here also, mixed well is better. And if you go now here for the, if you want to use it as a rack system and rack performance, you see here that mixed well is a little bit better. And also here for the mathematical chain of thought, mixed well is also a little bit better. So you might say, okay, this are the official published data. You see here other models, but I think most interesting is of course to compare a mixture of expert model to another mixture of expert model. And these are the data and these are the performance data here for your particular task. This was here on day one, two hours after it was released on Hugging Face. And I hope I've given you an idea that we have now in the same week Apache 2 license LLM from AI21 Labs called Jumba.